For all of you that own a Jack Russell Terrier right now, I have one question for you today. Do you think or does your Jack Russell Terrier lick you too much? That's right, I'm talking about just licking you for really no good reason or you may not know the reason or you're starting to get annoyed with it. Just like this. Guys, in this video today, I'm going to cover some of the reasons why your Jack Russell Terrier may have what you'd want to consider an obsessive licking issue, if it's even an issue, if it's something you need to worry about, or what you can do about it if you want that to stop in the future. That's what's coming up next. Stick around. All right, guys, like I said, we are going to cover why this dog right here, the Jack Russell Terrier, tends to lick so often for the owners, for the family in general. They just lick. It's a licking dog. And the first thing I can tell you about this dog when it comes to licking is a, it's not a concern, and B, they're doing it mainly just because they want attention. They want to show some love. They're an affectionate dog, and licking you is definitely one way to get your attention off of what you're doing and get your attention onto them. Whatever Luna here can do to steal my attention away from whatever I'm doing, whoever I'm talking to, she's going to do it. And obviously licking is one of the things that she has programmed into her brain to interrupt whatever I'm doing so that I redirect my attention towards her. So a quick summary of that number one reason why they're licking, it's nothing more than trying to get your attention and trying to show you some love. Number two guys, and this is pretty common with the Jack Russell Terrier is they could be licking you out of boredom. This dog does not like to sit and do nothing. Maybe in their older years, they might enjoy that a little bit more, but for the most part, this dog needs to be doing something. Whether they're outside, hanging out, having a good time, whether you're playing with them, or whether they're getting shown attention by somebody else in the household, or even playing with their own toys, they're usually on the move, they're usually following you around, and they wanna do something. So if it seems like you're sitting around a lot and all this dog is doing is licking you obsessively, maybe you need to get up and get a little more active with them because because they're probably just bored trying to get your attention like I said in the last one and they got nothing better to do. The next one guys is something that may be a little bit concerning but Jack Russell Terriers are known to to lick obsessively or excessively if they're going through some kind of anxiety or stress. A lot of the times with dogs you'll see this taking place more on their own body maybe licking their paws or between their toes but in general if it seems excessive or it just doesn't seem normal to you it could be stress related maybe a separation anxiety type deal um, whenever they're by themselves in a crate or you know just away from you maybe you notice that they're just going to town on themselves it could be it's kind of a boredom mixed with they're stressed out because you're not around and they have nothing to do type thing so if you think it might be that consider ways that you could alleviate the stress if you think it's becoming an issue which honestly it probably won't I've never dealt with it as an issue and Luna did have separation anxiety pretty bad in the beginning so it's just another reason why they might be doing it but I don't want to really cause any additional concern I wouldn't worry about it if I were you guys the next one I put down on my list to discuss today is they may just be used to licking you maybe you have given them positive reinforcement in some fashion just petting them while they're licking you that's positive reinforcement by itself just redirecting your attention towards them if they lick you that's their desired outcome. So they may just be used to using licking. <laughs> what, high five? Okay. As a mechanism to get those desired rewards out of you. It's nothing to be concerned with unless it's driving you nuts or you just absolutely despise it like you think it's just gross and horrible. If that's the case, then sure, do something about it. Redirect that and don't show any rewards for it. That doesn't mean discipline them for it. You're not going to get a dog to stop licking you by doing that. But if you reward them for doing it, they're going to keep doing that. Anybody would. Any human being continues to do things if it nets them a reward that they want. So keep that in mind, don't worry about it. But if it is bothering you, try and find a signal to them that is telling them like, oh, this doesn't do anything for me if I do that. And maybe it'll decrease some. You embarrassed? What's wrong? Eww. You lick obsessively too much. You lick too much. Those are kisses. Those are kisses, aren't they? The next one, guys, is super simple, but it's often overlooked with this topic. Like everybody just assumes that, you know, the licking may be an ish issue if it's too much, but you may taste good to your Jack Russell. That could be from sweat. You know, if you just worked outside all day long and mowed the yard, dogs lick sweat. I know it's disgusting. I know that they, you know, that it's not something we have to or need to talk about on this channel here, but it's the truth. If you are sweaty, it's, I don't know if it's that salt taste or what it is, but dogs are going to lick you in that situation. So don't go around your dog or allow them to lick you if you 
are sweaty and that will eliminate some of it. But if it tastes good to them, they're going to lick you. The same thing if you had like food residue on your hands, like it comes down to something as simple as that, right? God, your breath is crushed, man. It's whew. no more licking for you. I'm stinky, brush your teeth. Hey, real quick guys, mid video here. Luna and I would surely appreciate it if you gave us a little boop little thumbs up down below on the video. It helps our channel get seen by other individuals with Jack Russell Terriers. Helps us a ton. Give us a quick thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed and you would like to do so. Otherwise, I wanna dive into one of my favorite reasons why a Jack Russell Terrier might lick you, which is also super simple, but it's jealousy, especially when you have another dog in the house. And I do, I have Graham. It's almost like these two dogs, if they are around us together, they go into a licking battle. Graham usually doesn't jump on the furniture too much unless he's jealous. So let's say Luna jumped up and she's in my lap and then he jumps up, she immediately will go for the 100 licks in a row to keep my attention. And then he'll try and, you know, for a 100 pound dog, jump on my lap too, like he's a lap dog and he'll start licking my face. For these dogs, they use their licks as a form of love to get your attention and to try and keep it if they're jealous of what another dog is getting if they want that same attention. So if you have other pets in the house that you are showing that attention to and then your Jack Russell decides to lick you nonstop, it could just be a jealousy thing. And it could also be something as simple as, yes, you combine all of the reasons why I've already told you before, like the boredom or they want your attention, but maybe they want to play or maybe they need to go outside. Luna has licked me um, on my face to try and get my attention before. She is also, when my office was right by the back door where she goes outside to go potty, if I wasn't hearing her signals that she needed to go outside, she would just come up and try and lick my hand by putting her paws up on the chair so that she could reach it or even lick my leg. It's like they're one of the mechanisms they will use to communicate as well. So be paying attention. It could be something they're trying to tell you, such as I need to go outside and take a poop, or it could be the jealousy thing, like I just said. And then of course, this one it applies much more to Graham. Luna never really does anything to signal that she's hungry. She's a picky and a slow eater but Graham demolishes anything food related almost immediately and whenever he knows it's time to eat let's say it's coming up on 5 p.m. where I'm at and I haven't fed him yet he, that's when he will lick my face constantly back up look at me give me a little you know where's my food type deal, but maybe if your Jack Russell is licking you too much, they're trying to signal that they are hungry or thirsty and just another way to communicate with you. I mean, I'm not a dog scientist by any means, but I think a lot of the reasons dogs like a Jack Russell are gonna lick excessively or obsessively is mostly common sense. It's rarely a cause for concern. I would say 99% of the time it's to get your attention or just to get what they want. You know, Luna knows how to do it most dogs do and I wouldn't worry too much about it. I would however love to hear, you know, if your Jack Russell Terrier does lick excessively. Maybe they're not a licker at all. There are definitely dogs like that. I just don't happen to own either dog breed that is like that. So be sure to drop comments like that down below for us so we can all kind of, you know, get a feel for what this dog is really like for everybody who owns them. Again, guys, be sure to subscribe if you choose to and you have not already. We make new videos every Sunday at 11 a.m. Central Time. Be sure to tune into those by hitting the notification button down below. Again, a thumbs up for us goes a very long way, so please remember to do that. Never forget to check out TerrierOwner.com and keep an eye out for our new weekly vlogs that we're trying to get out. We're trying to get some additional content out for you guys and give you just a different view of Luna in these non-tutorial or frequently asked question type videos. So keep an eye out for whenever I do release those. They may replace the Sunday video. They may be in conjunction with that video on a different day. So we'll put them out there for you guys. Luna and I appreciate you stopping by. Hopefully you understand now why your dog is licking you so much. And we will see you guys in the next video. Take care.